the biggest advantage of the of a robot for microsurgery is is precision. We perform smaller and smaller operations and our eyes are enhanced by microscopes and these microscopes are getting better every year. The vessels are getting smaller and smaller and our human hand has a natural tremor. And this tremor is becoming more and more of a problem if you go very small. So the biggest advantage of the robot is it can filter out the tremor. Second thing is you can be very precise. Robots can be more precise than any human hand by motion scaling. So I can ask the robot to move one centimeter while my hand is doing 10. The quality of the surgery goes up because the precision of the surgeon increases. So the anastomosis quality is better, uh, which results in lower complications, better operations, uh, so faster recovery. There was a person uh, who accidentally cut off his thumb in a circular saw injury. The local hospitals couldn't help him, so they transferred the patient to uh, the hospital here in Maastricht and we replanted the thumb. So what you need to do then is put back the thumb, reconnect the bone, the tendons, uh, the nerves and the, the, the arteries and veins to get the thumb back on the patient, but also working and alive. I think it was about four, four and a half hours in total, uh, which is normal for an operation like that because you need to reconnect all these structures under a microscope. Surgeons are sitting behind microscopes uh, or oh, hanging over a patient in awkward positions sometimes for long hours. So neck problems, back problems uh, are very common. So an extra benefit of a robot would be that a surgeon can sit ergonomically while operating for long hours. In my opinion, surgeons will not be replaced by robots. Robot assistants can democratize uh, microsurgery. A lot of surgeons who are really good surgeons just don't have the precision in their hands. And a robot can enable any surgeon to get the precision. I think the early adopters are getting in now. And I think within a few years, a lot of people will start using robots uh, as it is common in other fields. And uh, an operation is always more than the trick itself. There are so many choices you have to make for a specific patient. There's so many situations that need judgment, but it can take a lot of parts of the operation uh, by itself. So uh, at the moment, robots are only exactly doing what the surgeon is doing, copying my movements. I think in the near future, parts of the operation might be done automatically, but the surgeon is always responsible and the surgeon will always be in control. A robot is a tool. Thank you.